We got a light drizzle. Let's see what's on the trap. Trap's missing again. Oh, it's definitely, definitely beaver. Uh, we got auto, <laughs> auto track here. Yeah, let me see that camera. That, that's a beaver track or auto track for my fingers. Is it rolling? Yeah. All right, everybody. Trap is gone out of the bed right there. If you look, there's an otter track. That there is a big beaver track right there. So we're going to pull this drag up out from underneath the water right out there. All right, let's find this here. Here we go. I just couldn't find it. Got pulled off to the right. Oh, right, guys. Got an otter. Oh, snap. Look at that. Awesome. We got the target catch. We got the otter track. So you know what happened here? Beaver went over, went that way, or his partner went that way. We got him by the front foot when he was coming up, scooting around. Got him by three toes. That's why you want to run drowners. If he wasn't on this drown bag, he'd have ringed his toes off and wouldn't have had him. Slid right to the bottom and died. Looks like a good male. <clears throat> he was caught either early this morning or last night. We pulled him beaver off last night, right by the front toes. That's what I want to see. Look at that. There's an otter. Look at that. Oh, yeah, man. That's pretty cool, right? What do you think about that? Look at them teeth. Got a little mud. Pretty cool, right? All right, take him and throw him back down over there with you, bro. Take him on down the hill. I'm going to get this stuff straightened out, okay, buddy? This is also why I was wondering why we had this in the cable. Hey, look at daddy. Drop is still bedded here on this set. We're gonna move on and check the other one. There's a deep little hole right here. Good stuff. I tell you, this swamp is full of big beaver. <laughs> so, see which way he was going? Remember me telling you back on the other trail where we pulled the otter up, there was a beaver track in the mud? Well, guess what? Took the otter on the drowner, took the beaver in the second set. This is why you always want to do double sets on the same runs. So if you catch one, if we only have one trap out there, we either, either miss that otter or miss the beaver. Now we got to reset this one. That's awesome. Fur is just rolling. Those dive pole sets putting in work. Yeah. I'm gonna move this again. Why is the log right there? Because that's the log to make them dive underneath. Make them dive underneath. <clears throat> Look at that, boy. All right, grab him, pull him up there. Pull him up. Don't fall in the water. Snatch him up on the bank, boy. Pull. Pull. Get him up there. Stand up. Pull. There you go. You got it. Stand up and pull. You're about to go. There you go. Get him up there. This is the... Go ahead. Stand up and pull him up some more. That is the... That's the smallest one we got so far out here. And it's still 25. You know what I'm saying? Look at that old slick tail on him, Jack. Look at that slick tail on him. Still 25. <laughs> That's a good looking furred beaver too. I mean floating dead like a submarine. Look at that perfect catch right behind the ears. Right behind the ears. Didn't feel nothing. Probably two seconds was done. Good work, William, pulling it out. Good job, buddy. Roll him over. There you go. Look at that thing. Well, is that his tongue right there? That's his tongue, teeth. Oh, yeah. Look how bad he's caked up here. Man, he's just a big one. He's a big one. Man, he's dug it up. I'm going to show you. Kyle didn't eat him all, did he? Look at him digging. Man, look at him digging. Man, look at him digging. 
I'm gonna tell you something right now. That Hoosier Trapper bait works. Oh yeah. It works good. Whatever that's good they, stuff. Whatever you got going on. That's the one guy I didn't want to catch. You know that, right? What is that, William? Foot's not tore up. Nope. Good. We can. We can. Photos because we go cut them loose. Yeah, we got to release this. Can't keep red fox in this county. All right, man. He's got this whole place smelling like yarn. All right. William, come back here behind me, okay? Good. Stay back behind me, okay, buddy? Right there. Okay. James is going to let him loose. All right, Kev, come here. Take his foot off the trap. Take it off gentle now. You got to use your hands. Use your hands because you broke William, come here. Break his wrist. William, come here. Stand right here. Hold this right here. Don't move it right there. I got him. You ain't gonna worry about that. Just reach, reach down there. I got him. Nice and easy. Nice pressure on him. Rub his foot out a little bit. Rub his foot out. He ain't too bad though. He'll, no. heal, he'll heal up. It actually feels good. Does it? Doesn't feel broken. There's a little blood there. Kind of massage the foot a Get little. Get some warmth back in there too. He's going to loaf away, but he'll heal up and be fine. Looking good? Yeah, it doesn't feel broken. It feels solid. Good. Watch <laughs> <it>. <laughs> All right, get that last photo. Come here, William. Come here. Come here, boy. Stand over here behind my shoulder. Come here. Come on. Come on. Let's get that last photo. good oh yeah all right you ready come back over here with daddy there we go watch watch he's gonna run off <laughs> that front foot's moving just fine oh yeah running good into the woods why didn't he not i said he, <laughs> he took right off like a rabbit did yeah he? he did that was a good release there you go all right so listen oop, oop, don't step in that stuff come on out here wow. everything smells like fox urine all right, so we're not gonna be able to do a reset right now because we don't have the equipment on the truck. We took my buddy's truck today, Kevin's driving. So tomorrow we'll do a reset, but it stunk up pretty good with Red Fox. After this rain kind of kills some of the scent down, it's still gonna be a bunch when I rake it back again. It'll refresh in that scent. We'll go ahead and make a set back and uh, keep working the line. So that's been about, been about a week on this actually, to be honest with you. Yeah. And we since, up that, that red. since that original burn circle one we reset in the coyote video yeah we we're letting folks know you can reset on these burn circles and it took a red fox so it doesn't bother them yep so and i wanted to let that guy go uh one thing is we can't keep him in our county but the other thing is i've been watching that fox all year out here and it's just beautiful to see red foxes we got one more uh bit of line to check where we've done a lot of otter sets so we're uh Gonna head back to the truck. Nothing left over here where we've got coyotes and bobcat sets set up. So we're gonna jump back in the truck, go check those. That's it. All right. Well, we just checked our otter line here. Got nothing on there. So the count today, a little short check, was uh, one beaver, one otter, one red fox we cut loose. This is Kevin and James and William with Lazy Pond Farm Fish and Hunt. Please hit that like and subscribe and uh, stay tuned. We'll be bringing you more videos. Thank you.